Well, at this time, Chicago police are searching for the driver that ran away from the scene of that horrific crash. At this time, it's unknown whether that crash caused the death of a six month old baby girl. Now, according to police, the driver of a Chevy SUV was traveling westbound on 63rd and Cottage Grove when it ran a red light and crashed into a Ford SUV at the intersection. The vehicle struck two other cars. Police say a man and a woman in the Ford vehicle were taken to an area hospital with non life threatening injuries. Police say there was a six month old baby girl in the Ford vehicle that was struck. Her parents were already taking her to Comer's hospital for breathing difficulties. Police say the baby died in the hospital, but again, it's unknown if it was due to the impact of the crash. A witness described what happened. The white truck ran the light. The tail in the black, the black truck. I mean, the impact it hit it so hard to well. My reaction sink when I when I seen it, I tried to hurry up and swerve over to get out the way. Bounced off the gray truck, hit the silver car, and, and that's where it landed. Now, police say a man and a woman were inside the Chevy SUV that ran that red light. Uh, both adults did run away from the scene of the crash. Neither of them are in custody at this time. Live outside Comer's Children's Hospital, Angelica Sanchez, WGN News.